Hi everyone, I'm Dream, and welcome to my YouTube channel. My previous series of PPT rotation animation videos have gotten a lot of views on YouTube. Thank you so much for your support. Many of you have encountered issues while trying to replicate them, and these problems can be grouped into four categories. First is the PPT version issue. Not all versions support the morph transition used for the animation. Second, the animation stops working after modifying content. Third, text can't move up or down smoothly. Fourth, the background doesn't display properly during rotation and turns white. In this video, I'll analyze each issue and provide solutions one by one. Okay, let's start with the PPT version problem. According to Microsoft official guidelines, PPT 2019 and later versions can create and play morph transitions normally. Older versions have limited functionality, and some require installing plugins. So if you want to use the morph effect, I recommend upgrading to PPT 2019 or later. Also, make sure the computer you use for presentations has the same or newer version. Otherwise, your animation might not display correctly. Second issue, the animation stops working after modifying content. Let's go back to PPT, find the morph transition, and hover your mouse over it. You'll see the requirements for using morph. Simply put, the objects on the slides being transitioned must be consistent. The best way is to duplicate a slide first, then move the elements around. For example, if I make a simple modification here, the animation won't follow the rotation. Instead, it will have a fade out and fade in effect. To keep the objects consistent, I need to make the same modification to the changed content on the second slide. Let's check again. Now the animation plays smoothly. If you make any changes, ensure the core objects remain unchanged. But it's easy to make mistakes. So the safest method as per the guidelines, is to duplicate the slide first before editing objects. This way, the morph effect will work correctly. Third issue, text can't move up smoothly. Where's the problem? Let's zoom out the PPT. You'll see that I combined the content of four slides into one group. On the second slide, I moved this grouped text up one position, and using morph creates the upward movement effect. Each subsequent slide moves the group up from its previous position, resulting in the smooth upward motion. If you have many slides, this editing method can be inconvenient. So here's a second approach, as shown in this example. The content on each slide here also achieves a smooth upward slide. On the first slide, I place the content for the second slide at the bottom of the page in advance. Then on the second slide, I move the first slide's content to the top and the second slide's content to the center. Note that on this slide, I also place the third slide's content at the bottom in advance. On the third slide, I'll move the second slide's content to the top and the third slide's content to the center. Similarly, I've prepared the fourth slide's content at the bottom in advance. Remember to add the next slide's content to each page beforehand and move the previous slide's content off-screen. Fourth issue, the background isn't set properly, so it remains the default white. This is an easy fix. Let's look at this example. The shape's color isn't intentionally set to white. Instead, it's set to background fill. The image here isn't set as the slide background. It's placed as an image on top of the slide. That's why the shape shows the white background. What I need to do is cut the image and set it as the slide's background. Now, during the transition, the shape will be filled with the background, creating a smooth effect. All right, these are the common reasons why the rotation animation can't be replicated. I hope this solves your questions. I'm Dream. I love using fewer tools to do more things. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more tips. See you next time.